was good too. As y'all can see, I just got out of work. So I apologize. But today's video, I'm going to be explaining y'all the explaining to y'all the um the five signs of grief, right? And why it's important to know the five signs of grief. It just why it's important for y'all to know like the five signs of grief of grief is that typically we tend to go through grief and that you know grief could be over anything a relationship a friendship a death in the family and i feel like it's good to know like like what's really happening to you so i'm gonna be going over the five the five signs of grief and you know if y'all ever went through grief y'all let me know which sign to y'all hit the hardest and make y'all feel a certain type of way about yourself right so number one Number one is denial. That could be in a relationship or a death. Like for me, when my brother passed, I was in denial. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't, you feel me? I ain't think like, I ain't even think it really happened. Even to this day, I, I think I'm still in denial about him passing. Like it really don't feel like that he really gone. You get what I'm saying? So it says denial can look like you easily dis distract it. You trying to keep busy all day, or you got mindless behavior, and it can feel like shock, numbness, confusion, and shutting down, which is all the signs that I was feeling. Right? Okay, we on to the next. The next say anger. Anger. Like I said, it could be for a relationship, friendship, or. Death, like you'll be mad that you feel me that happened to him, or you'll be mad that that person did that to you, or or, or or that you feeling that type of way. So you'll go through anger, and it says anger can be a passive or being anger can look like being aggressive or passive aggressive, get into a physical argument or altercation, increase use of alcohol and drugs and it can feel like impatience frustration resentment embarrassment rage and feeling out of control it's important for y'all to know this like so y'all can know which signs y'all going through when y'all dealing with something in your life right okay the next one is bargaining it could look like Reminating on the future of past, think about the future of past or what could have happened or what you could have did. Overthinking and worrying, anxiety. Anxiety, always feeling something inside your chest. Comparing yourself to other, what you could have did, what you could, or how he looked, how she looked for a relationship. Pre pre predicting the future and assuming the worst, thinking that it's gonna be worse in the future that you ain't gonna never get over this milestone. And it says bargaining can feel like guilt. You blame yourself. Shame, blaming yourself. Anxiety, always worrying, thinking it's your fault. And insecurity, thinking about yourself, thinking it's your fault that this happened. You feel me? Okay, the next sign is depression. It could look like sleep loss of appetite sleep reduce energy you don't want to do nothing you want to stay in the bed we do motivation lack of motivation crying increase alcohol or drug use and this can feel like sadness you feel like you helpless and hopeless and you disappointed you could be disappointed that that person left you or you could be disappointed that as in like your brother passed or a family member passed and you feel overwhelmed and Helpless, like you, it's not nothing you could do about the situation, but but accept it, which is the next one. Acceptance. It can look like being in the present moment, asserting yourself, adapting and and coping with what's going on, and it can feel like 
courage like you got courage self compassion pride and wisdom and validation so these are the five signs of grief you feel me and you feel me it's good to know which sign is which and what's really going on with you like if you have a brother that died or a relationship that or a marriage or a relationship that didn't last and you feel in these type of ways these are the five signs of grief and this is why it's important because it's important it's, it's it's important to know what's going on with yourself and your body and how you feeling and and it's important to know that everybody goes through what you're feeling and you're not the only one to go through it and you just gotta get through it and you gotta overcome it you know what i'm saying so yeah it's a quick little video of me explaining the five signs of grief and me really breaking it down to y'all Y'all like, y'all like, y'all coming, y'all coming. You feel me? I'm gonna keep the videos coming.